All right, following week update on EN. EN has started making its way to the trough of the right shoulder like I wanted it to from uh, 1219's markup. It's been taking a little bit of a while. Only because on the four hour chart, it's been making quite a bit of moves. So it's been in this little double kind of top, not really, but I'm just gonna kind of stick with the, the larger time frame with this uh, particular uh chart only because it looks a little bit smoother less way a lot less noise um i did see what i wanted to see with the rejection over at this level here price did close above it's kind of signaling that um, i'm expecting it to go above that level but it did close below the next level also uh, immediately and then confirming that with two uh immediate confirmation candles so i am expecting price to bounce off of this level right here um, so I just I want to see um, a bullish CSP once price gets to here. Other than that, it is doing exactly what it wants to. Uh, what I'm looking, what I'm expecting it to do, what I've been expecting it to do. So. All right, with EN looking at it, it was in or is in this um, inverted head and shoulders on the daily. Scrolling down to see a little bit more what's happening was that the 38% level was a level that it respected made a cool uh, double bottom actually kind of made a triple bottom just because it did test that that level right here with the wick um, quite nicely after it did that I started this ramp up to the next level being the neckline closed above the neckline made a little bit of a structure there just so it can come back to the order block of the uh, bottoms that it made uh, for the right the trough of the right shoulder and then it ramped up, made a cool little double bottom for the order block, and that's just more confirmation um, signaling that it, it, it was gathering the necessary uh, contracts from the market that it needed to, to continue upward. Finally got the close above the next level after the neckline, and just waiting on that confirmation. That extra confirmation is just going to put a little sauce on top that is going to continue, but it's had a pretty, very strong breakout from the, um, the order block's trough. Or the trough's order block, excuse me. So, looking here, I mean, it's it's kind of doing its thing, and it's not really gonna it's gonna eat a little bit of the market as it as it continues moving because this pair likes to move. But no complaints, doing what it needs to do. Um, got the close above, and this day obviously started not too long ago, so it's gonna continue doing what it does. All right. So after the breakout of the neckline uh, from this inverted head and shoulders. Uh, Ian has still been uh, make, <clears throat> making his run. Um, six, eight, eight, nine as a level that it broke above and confirmed with a little bit of consolidation, a few doji candles, um, and then it started making a, a larger push upward to that 7,000 level. And now price is currently testing that 7,000 level. So troubles are on, um, and this this pattern is is pretty much completed and it started its run. And so if it does, <clears throat> if it does end up making a reversal for whatever reason, it's going to hit a trailer and collect profit. So, um, yeah, the the next high that I would have to clear is the next level that being at that sell zone plus a thirty eight percent extension level. So I would expect price to break above that and continue its its bullish run that it's been on to complete this reversal pattern.